Welcome back to our channel. Ladies and gentlemen, today we are going to tour an exceptional beauty of a home on our Amaro Brothers channel. Thank you, first and foremost, once again, to Sol Villa, the exclusive listing agent, to allow us to tour the stunning home. Patrick and I, we both fell in love. We're brothers, by the way, for those who are new to our channel. But before I say too much, ladies and gentlemen, it's gonna be our pleasure to show you this home, so let's begin, come on. Wow, already the sourced wooden door entering into the foyer of this home sets the mood. Everything in this home is so chic, it's so custom made and elegant. I'm in love, really, I have to say. So let me just give you a quick brief on how the layout of this home looks. Obviously, this is your entry foyer. You come here, take off your shoes, get ready to go out, whatever you need to do. Very nice that they put this seating area here. We have the kitchen, staff compartment, dirty kitchen, laundry to the right, staircase leading up to the first floor with four bedrooms. Right up front, we have a super elegant living room that we're gonna be exploring now. So with no further ado, let the property tour begin. And hey, if you liked all the detail shots and drone shots of this home, give us a thumbs up and comment below. Let's go. So guys, <laughs> you've seen it in the detail shots of this former living room area. It's flawless. The color paneling of the entire house is so sophisticated. The style and the finishes are superb. And Patrick and I, we both said it, and please agree, we love the home the minute we walked into it. Not only is it modern, but it has a nice fusion between Mediterranean and of course also the Scandi chic decor throughout that makes this place such a lovely home. Isn't that right, Patrick? Come on. Yes, and real fireplaces. Yeah, <laughs> as you guys key, might key know. Point. It's true. For those new to the channel, we always love fireplaces. I usually call them chimneys, but that is not correct English. Needless to say, guys, this room is beautiful. It's also intermediate to the dining area. And of course, this entire section that we're gonna be exploring now. This would be your informal chill out section with another fireplace. You obviously have French windows wrapping around, bringing so much natural light into this informal living room area. And it's right adjacent to an office space, <laughs> space. Office space <laughs> that I fell in love with because yes, we edit our own videos, Patrick and I, and I can just totally picture it coming here. Patrick sitting here, I'm sitting there working on our property tour videos for you guys for the entertainment. So if you are entertained, smash that like button, support the Marrow gang. Now these, guys. These curved screens are just awesome. Amazing. I wonder if they're dual split that you would actually have. 100%. Yeah. Maybe we should get one, Patrick, an upgrade. We should, we should sit and work exactly like this. This is just perfect for the Mara Brothers. Think about it. Since home office has become such a big thing, this place is fantastic. You have visibility to the living room. You have the hallway. You can even see all the way down to the dirty kitchen that we're going to be exploring later. Everything is possible from here. 
and of course natural light coming out of the Roman windows with Scirocco wood. Let's continue, come on. Little gallery way here, store your stuff, and of course a guest toilet. Let's explore it together. You guys know how much we like guest toilets. Here, first and foremost, in the mirror, that's my dear brother, Patrick. And for those who are confused, we are real brothers. That's why we're called the Mario Brothers. The Mario Brothers. Yes, and the Mario Brothers. Not, not, the, Ma not the Mario Brothers, the Mario Brothers. YouTube calls us Mario Brothers. Anyways, we're a big fan of wallpaper. Always add a nice charm and warmth to every room. Villaroy and Boch sinks in all the house. Of course, a toilet, but everything's here. And as you can see, the elegance and design goes throughout the entire house. Soft closing, magnetic, and also cupboard spaces. Now let's continue. Back into the hallway, the landing, straight up to more. But before I go to more, down these stairs, guys, there's insane spa. Actually, maybe we shouldn't spoil it, but we have a spa, we have an indoor heated swimming pool, a sauna, a gym, everything that the heart can think of, what luxury can get you in the world is down there. But we're not going there yet, so stay tuned till the end. Let's continue. This is your formal dining area in all its sheer elegance. And yes, guys, you might have seen I'm wearing my Christmas attire with little snowmans and Christmas trees because it is already December in Marbella, in the whole world, I would actually say. But hey, Marbella is in the south of Spain. It's an enclave. It's beautiful for those who don't know because I heard that some people don't know about Marbella. What? Marbella is like the Miami of Europe. Anyways, we have Christmas. Christmas tree is already put here. You can find dine with your friends. And I just want to point out once again, the detail to lighting in this entire house is epic. You will see it in the night shots. Everything is thought through. Full ceiling as well to hide air conditioning and sound system. Everything is here. Patrick? And don't forget the nice passageway oh. to the living room. Yeah, just, it's so warm. It's so, it fuses the color combo of this house, the color panels. For me, it's just the warmest, the most comfy home we have seen so far. It's another home I would buy if oh, I only had. Uh, it, is, it is the house I would buy. Yeah, Patrick walked in here and he was like, I'm buying it. Yeah. But if you're already interested, up on the right, you'll see a banner pop up. So Villa are the exclusive listers of this home. And we're the first to tour this home and this insanely beautiful kitchen. Now, as you can see, do you catch the round dining table here? It's more informal. It is in the socket, which is surrounded by the pocketing windows that slide open, giving you that nice view outside to your manicured garden where we will go to later. But before we do, kitchen time. Should we show them the kitchen? Let's go. I don't know where to begin, <laughs> to be quite frank. This is a massive kitchen island. Let's start off with that fact. Fact number one, Danspan customized kitchen, Miele and Gagina appliances. What's really cool and you do not see that often in homes is that you have countertop number one with a sink, sandstone countertops by the way, but you also have in the kitchen island here another sink, a flat laying sink, I don't know, to wash your fruits and peel them, spray them off, super handy. So everything in this home is efficient and was created probably just to have the workflow easier. Now, Miele induction, Gaginal substractor, Miele appliances, double fridge by Gaginal, what I very much like, and Patrick pointed it out. You have these steel door handles that feel, they've got this rippled grip that just, Patrick said it feels like a dumbbell at the gym. But that's custom made. Like an El Aiko. You know El Aiko, the, the barbells from them? Yeah, exactly. Super nice and touch though. So it, just to open the fridge is amazing. That's a twin fridge by Gaginau, freezer, wine cooler, and you have all the storage facilities above and on the side. 
It's just a multifunctional kitchen. It's not the only kitchen in this house, by the way. There's a dirty kitchen, and I wouldn't even call it a dirty kitchen. It's a chef's kitchen, and we're gonna be exploring it soon. Now, Second Christmas tree. Quick note, guys, Christmas is approaching, so if you wanna buy yourself a nice big present, this home's for sale. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Chef's kitchen, ladies and gentlemen, with a glass roof bringing natural light in. Once again, look at the appliances. For instance, this fur dinkum oven here, microwave. It's a pizza oven, no? It's a pizza oven, another fridge, meal induction, gagging out so you can structure. Look at this. It's fur dinkum, it's massive. This is where the chef comes, prepares all the fine dining for when you're having a party or you're hosting an amazing Show us, event. All right, so. Ta-da! Put this on and you get working. You've got everything you need. You also have a deep fryer here, all fridges, freezers, everything's here and natural light coming from above. And if you turn around real quick, access point out to the outer terrace that we're gonna be going to explore at a later stage. But this is by far the coolest Dirty kitchen. If we can even call it a dirty with, kitchen. With natural light coming from yeah. above. I, that's what I love. I have to say, this part is epic. I wanna cook here. There's more. Basically, you see me walk through the door. I would call this entire area your stuff compartment because upstairs you have a fully independent bedroom with kitchen, access point door here, and a laundry slash closet walk in through your garage door room. Let's explore. I think this room's amazing and I'll explain you guys why. You have a point, you have a point, you have a door right there. That door leads to the carport. So you park your car, you come in here. The first thing you do is you hang your jacket, take your shoes off, store them in all the cupboards and places that you can right up there. You can also, when you bring your shopping, put it straight up into a fridge this one I call the beverage fridge. It's full of drinks. And we, not, we are not doing any advertisement for Noco or Coca-Cola. No or Red Bull. Red Bull. Hey, sponsor us. <laughs> <laughs> All right, super cool. What do you think, Patrick? Because it's you're amazing. so quiet. No, no, I, I, I told you in the beginning, this house is just, I mean, I'm, 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 I would say it's homey, it's styled, out throughout, throughout. and, and, and it's good... super clever don't you think yes it's super clever clever oh my god my english and it's clever the colors there's a lot of brown in the house makes it much more cozier yeah and warmer what do you guys think we are always reading the comments below so make sure to comment below and let us know what you guys think about this home Ta -da! Yes, that's patrick by the way thumbs up for my big brother who is doing the camera work today. We still have right there a laundry room. So let's explore, ta-da, laundry room. Washing machines, carpet spaces, more fridges, sink, countertop to work from, separate access point. So think about it. You live in this home, you definitely have someone who takes care of everything. They can come in this section of the house without interrupting the main living areas of it. And before we go to the staff apartment, let me show you where this door leads to. This door leads to the carport, where we started the property tour. This one's partially covered, this one's partially opened, but you have a very elegant drive-in to your private home where you can park many cars. That's the door we started our property tour with. And yeah, now I'd say, guys, let's start to look at the bedrooms upstairs. Let's go. Shall we? Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Guys, you see the LED dog shots once again. This room is so styled out. It's a fully independent apartment basically you have your kitchenette here you have a living room area you have a west facing terrace it's fully designed out and it's another room where i would say i would love to live in here this is 
I maybe shouldn't be saying it, but it's probably nicer than my apartment, house, tent. We live in a tent in the mountains. Camper. Camper. Let's continue, have a quick glance to the bedroom because yes, there's also a bedroom. You following? Yes, let's go. Let's look. You've seen it. Styled out, natural light coming in. Once again, natural wood on the floor, covered spaces. Have you shown this in the little shots? Yes. Do Perfect, you. what more do you need? It's a fully independent room. I could move in here tomorrow, so if you're watching it, dear owner, uh, maybe we could live here for a while. What do you think? What would you, Patrick, would you live here? I would like to buy it, because it's for sale then. I know. All right, let's continue. So, you can also pocket these doors closed, and that will create the completely independent working staff compartment area. Yes, love the kitchen. We haven't yet shown, did we, Patrick? that you have Italian sourced herringbone oak wood on the floor in many rooms. Should we show that now? Okay. By the okay. Christmas tree and my naked feet. Look how nice this is. This is what I mean, it's in this darker brown that distinguishes itself to the lighter colors of the other elements of the house, creating a nice disruption. Now, here is a server room, we're not going dining area that we have shown you. And upstairs, four bedrooms. Four bedrooms? Yes, one, two, three, four. So let's explore them, come on. So guys, on the first floor here, we have four bedrooms. Two bedrooms on the right side of the house, two bedrooms on the left. Basically, this entire section is the master quarters with an additional bedroom. We're gonna be exploring that later, because before, point out, upstairs we have an insane cinema room. Patrick and I would love to chill there, watch a couple of movies. It's so cozy. We'll come to that later. First bedroom number one. You've seen it in the detail shots. Once again, stylish throughout. And I love the wallpaper bringing that freshness to the room. Also an access point out to the terrace that we're gonna be exploring at a later stage, which is quite handy for this bedroom and an ensuite bathroom, let's have a look together. Come on. Now, we have a one sink vanity here, micro cemented walls, underfloor heating, by the way, throughout. Patrick right now, fun fact, is standing in the bathtub, so maybe you wanna get out real quick so we can show it. Bathtub with a nice French sort of balcony opening up. You have La Concha Mountain just at the far end. And yeah, toilet, shower, everything you need is here. Should we continue? Let's go. Let's go. Come on, there's so much more. Let's start with this bathroom. Come on. Toilet, bidet, two sink vanity, shower. This bathroom would belong to bedroom number two, which is this one. Now, all the bedrooms are nicely sized. This one has a really cool military combo style camouflage painting on the wall, which is cool. It also has an access point to the terrace. You get to see the sea, by the way, that unfolds just outside. Great bedroom. Now, this entire suite, as I explained earlier, is basically the master's quarters with a walk-in closet, a bedroom in case you have a small little child. Everything we'll be exploring now. I would say, should we start with this one? Let's go. Now, this is really clever, because you have to think, if you're a family living here and you just have a newborn baby, you want him or her to be super close to the parents' bedroom. And that was the whole idea of this room. And I think that's very considerate and I'm a big fan. So if your child wants to sleep in your bed because he's scared of ghosts, he will find you very easily. Right, Patrick? Because yes. you were always so scared of ghosts. Of course not. You slept in mama's bed. <laughs> <laughs> Me being the scared one. Why not? Okay, let's go. What is this, Patrick? It's a walk-in closet. Yes, it is. Yes. Let's, let's discover it. You, you, took, you took my words. Yeah, Come go. on. All right, guys, you've probably seen it in the detail shots of the home in general, but there's a lot of Louis Vuitton going on in this home, so I presume the owner likes it. Like these 
briefcases and suitcases here from Louis, which are very difficult to source. From Louis? <laughs> from, from Louis. our friend Louis. <laughs> from me, amigo Louis. Hey, Luigi. Hey, Luigi. So a lot of cupboards and storage for your clothes. Oh, wait, sorry, Louis Vuitton is not Italian, no? It's, I think it's French Louis. Ah. It's Olivier. No, Louis. I Louis don't know, know how to say it in French. Anyways, guys, big fan that the closets are closed because of dust. Don't like it when they're open and other homes are just open for humidity and dust to get in, but this one's nicely closed. A lot of space here and there. This big middle console for your socks is also really cool. And Patrick, if you want to turn the camera around, this is just another eye for detail. The handle here, it's difficult to show. I don't want to open it, but come closer. Just the handles and all the closets here and cupboards is made out of the same bronze as we have seen detailed in many other things. And yeah, Patrick hit his head on the chandelier because Patrick is two meters tall. So be careful, Patrick, I need you. Let's continue, come on. Thank you for, the... for, for like mentioning that I hit myself. Sorry, man. I was come really on. holding it in, the pain. <laughs> I think our audience wants to see that you're getting hit by chandeliers. I, so must, I, be, I must be honest, after like a while, being so tall, you get used to bumping your head. Being tall is also a good measurement for you guys to understand the height. I'm 183, so we have a double height ceiling here. Great. And a beautiful custom-made dance band master bathroom. Let's have a look, come on. Right guy, <laughs> there is a toilet. It's all stage, I haven't actually used it. Now this is the master's walk-in massive room that we would call a bathroom, double sink vanity in this one big long stretching console, micro cemented walls partially in this bathroom and the floor right now, it's probably 30 degrees. You can crack an egg on it and it's so nice to walk on barefoot so thank you for thinking about it now moving on from that we have a double head shower as well here which is really cool because i'm a fan of showering with my partners and you definitely wait, wait, wait. your partners your partner with my one beloved partner i just thought it sounds more interesting if there are multiple people I, that's what i meant to say no i have a shower party and you can definitely do that right here underneath this I would shower. Even, I, if I, I would put them on even showering alone. Just, yeah. I would walk and think. Yeah. Like, da, 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 I don't know, da, just da. walk, be like doing like little circles. Or, or you know, you train. <sighs> okay. <laughs> it's getting too stupid. Anyways, you get the point. Uh, my partner, I hope you're not bad. All right, let's continue. Because we also have the master bedroom that we would like to show you now. Once again, I want to point out it is detailed throughout this entire house. This would be where the main person of the house sleeps. You have a nice view actually, factually, to the east, which brings you morning sun in. You also have a terrace that we're gonna be exploring now. So turn the camera around. Wait, 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 wait. Tell me, what's up? A fireplace. A fireplace, Patrick's a huge fan of fireplaces, so am I. You've got this, uh, this easy this, chair, this, this lounge chair. I would chill. Yeah. Put on a fire, lay down there. Read a book. And waiting for some my partner. Some Dostoyevsky, some literature. Waiting for my partner. Yeah, your partners. My partners. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, by the way, Roman windows, double glazed, really fur denkum, good quality. And the outdoor area that we're gonna be exploring now, so let's go. Nice place to come, tank in some sun. This is also the terrace that wraps all the way around to the first or second bedroom that we have seen. It is a south facing terrace. And if you turn the camera, you have a panoramic view to the sea and greenery. Sea Gibraltar today, 
far distance a nice layer of clouds where Africa is. Maybe it's raining there because in Marbella it is sunny. And we have a microclimate. It's absolutely amazing the microclimate. Thanks to La Concha. Which is there. We're going to be showing it maybe at a later stage because I would you I would like you Patrick just to turn the camera to show them the manicured garden which is just under 2600 square meters big. Where the house sits, by the way, it has been elevated so that you get this nice open view to the sea and greenery. And just in the sunken in part down there, you have your heated outdoor swimming pool and a guest house with two ensuite bedroom apartments, basically. Very cool. We'll come to that at the later stage because, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for tuning in. Like and subscribe, thumbs up. If you like the house, the details of the exclusive lister are in the description box of the video. Patrick? So via. Yeah, of course, I was gonna say that. I wanted yeah, to put cool. emphasis on it. Thank you to our amazing collaborator, Soul Villa, for allowing us to tour this listing. We're the first. We're gonna be delighted to present it to you guys. All the contact details are in the description box. And now it's time, get your popcorn to look at the spa in the basement. So stay tuned. No, 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 no. And let's go. Popcorn ready for the cinema. Patrick, that was supposed to be a surprise. Let's go. Nice corridor, by the way. A lot of eye for detail to the recess lighting in the entire house with dimmers. So everything, you can dim the atmosphere of the house. So cool. Stairs going up to an amazing soundproofed cinema. Let's go. Right, guys, I love this room. It is in the peak of the house. It is fully isolated, by the way. Sound isolated, so. Ah! <clears throat> I told you, absolutely nothing. And it's so cozy. Imagine coming here with your friends, your family, watching a couple of Mar Brothers property tours or any other cool movies. <laughs> and yeah, just enjoy your time. Big fan. What do you think, Patrick? Awesome. Just yeah? Awesome. Yeah. Also, that is at the top of the house. Yeah. Which is cool because they always put it in the basement. This basement, by the way, is just a full spa awesomeness. So we'll come to that now. Anything else we should say here? Not really, right? No, please subscribe and like our videos. <laughs> subscribe <laughs> and like our videos. See you in the spa basement now. Let's go. Boom. Ladies and gentlemen, this is by far the most sexiest basement with full-on amenities we've ever seen. Let's start off with the obvious. You have a heated indoor swimming pool, which is pretty epic, with mosaic shimmering tiles. You have an entire, on the left side here, entire section, section, sex, an entire section of a gym that we're going to be looking at because gyms are always what Patrick loves the most. Yes, fitness. Fitness. Let's have a look. Fully functional. We believe in fitness. I do indeed. We all believe in fitness. You have running machines, cardio section, bench press right here. I think they're called air bikes, no? Air, oh yeah, 100% rogue air bikes. bikes. It says echo, but so you can yeah, I mean, you use these, they will definitely destroy you. Oh yeah, this is like cardio times yeah. 10. Actually, we, you might imagine that later we're gonna go to the guest apartment, which is a separate little house by the pool. You might as well just take a bicycle there and do some exercise by the pool, then jump into the cold water. Mm. Yeah. Or, or do it here. I mean, you've got a swimming pool inside of your own house as well. Obviously, if you want you to have train. A, a rack here. A rack. You have some free weights, a TV. Always nice to look at some some machinery stuff. as well. And some a cables. booty builder. Booty builder. This is gonna sound very sensual. The original hip thrust machine. Hip thrust. Damn, yes. And if you're not into gym, but you turn the camera around, there is an entire room for yoga. Should we have a look? Okay, yeah, whoa. Let's pop it. Could actually just have a whole members club created just for this section down here, where you could come and do your yoga 
jump into the pool, swim some laps because they're jet streams so that you can continuously swim, do some exercise in your own gym, throw some basketball hoops because there's a little basketball section out there as well and do everything inside of this place and charge a monthly fee. I did yoga once and that was it. But now moving away from yoga, this overhang made out of wood is really epic. You also have LED strips on the front side and nice illumination on the wooden panels. And that theme goes throughout the entire basement as well, which is super cool. And right behind this machi uh, machine, behind this wall, you're so close, we have a jacuzzi in the same mosaic, shiny tiling as the swimming pool there. And it's really cool because you can lie down on these ones here as well. And if you're tired of lying, you also have a sunbed, did you realize? <laughs> yeah. You can come and suntan here or just chillax on one of these kickback chairs. And if that's not enough, guys, there is more. I told you, I promised you a lot. So stay tuned because we also have a Zauna. Zauna? Zauna, Patrick's favorite room. Let's have a quick look because this is an enormous sauna. You have space for 12 people, maybe even more. You can get really sweaty in here and close some business deals with your partners. We have more. You can get your masseuse to come over. Masage. And get a masage, a massage. Message? A massage. massage. How cool is this? You have your own massaging room in your house. Like I said, you don't have to leave the basement to have a full spa treatment day. And that's epic. And that's all in your own house. And I have to say, this is also the section that brings so much value to the house. Double shower. It's necessary. And hey, this is another fun fact. Patrick, Ha'ir. 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 You get your own barber to come into your own hair saloon to wash your hair and cut it. That's also part of your spa area. And I think that's epic. Don't you, guys? 100%. And Patrick, guys? Patrick? Guys, Patrick? Guys? Patrick. If you're not a fan of peeing in the pool, you can do <laughs> <laughs> You have your bathroom here. Not gonna go into finer details because you know what you do there. Now, it's time to head back upstairs because we also have the full hotel-like apartment in the swimming pool house. But before we do, should we show them the switches? I think they're so cool. These switches are all around the house and you can control anything you want with them, the lighting system, etc. There's also a domotic system that controls everything in the house, like the underflow heating, that's right. You know what I mean. But these switches are epic. It's like uh, from a cockpit. Yeah. Like switch on the engines. Especially when you're organoleptic, which means that you like touching things and feeling them, they have a really nice feel to them. Yes. Touching or feeling things. There's more. We can There's the basketball court outside. Have you seen it already? Let's have a look. Come on. You have a NBA approved basketball hoop right here. And ladies and gentlemen, we've done it in the house before. If we get it in, you subscribe and you like our video. I'm going to go for the first try and then Patrick goes from the three pointer line, which is actually here. Can you get this far? Watch this. Ah. One more time. There you go. Was that third time lucky? Or oh, fourth time lucky? Okay, Patrick, first time. Come on, don't embarrass us. <laughs> right, guys, you get the point. There is even this little entertainment area that you can make use of. And it's just outside your swimming pool, indoor spa area. And now it's time to go to the pool house. And subscribe. Did you go in? All right, yes, you can also unsubscribe. We're not biased here. Let's go back inside and up to the garden, which we haven't shown you yet, so let's go. Okay, let's continue. If you did like the basement with the spa and the jacuzzi and indoor swimming pool, which is heated, give us a thumbs up. And now let's check out the outdoor living space. Outdoor dining at its finest, ladies and gentlemen, nicely shaded under the gazebo. Just picture it, it's summer, it's warm. You got your friends over, you're enjoying the shade. What are you gonna do? You're gonna fry up some veggies in your barbecue stove right here. And if you don't like barbecue, uh, there are some people who don't, very strange. 
Patrick, look at this. Little pizza oven. You can even make a pizza. I think this is really cool. Yeah. If the house gets sold, I'm calling this. That's a guess on one. I've seen them already on Amazon once. We should get one. Yeah. Well, 100%. Pizza size is too small. You also have here a sink. That's the door that leads into the chef's kitchen that we have shown you before. The staircase leads down to a one car garage space and further parking spaces available. And of course, all this beauty that we're gonna explore. explore. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, into the sun. Nice and warm, it's December, ladies and gentlemen. We on our YouTube channel where we tour luxury real estate, not only sell homes, but also the lifestyle, 320 days of pure sunshine. That's also what Sovilla is selling, the exclusive listing agent of this one of a kind home. And I have to say it is stunning. And we're gonna be looking at it from a different angle at a second. First and foremost, real quick attention, look on how the hedges are cut. We've actually spoken to the gardener of this home that works on maintaining it and keeping it as beautiful as it is now every day. Good job. And now this. Did you show them that? Our favorite mountain. Here I could literally say it's a stone throw away. You could literally grasp it in the palms of your hands. That's how close it is. And I would say just the mountain itself is already worth two million. And you can go run up the mountain. Yeah, perfect. Morning exercise. You're so right. You have a lot of access points to climb La Concha yeah, even from here. Come on. From this angle, cool. it might not look as high, but it is quite it, steep. It's what, Patrick, you climbed it with me various times. How much time do you think it takes? My record was three hours. In three hours? Yeah. Wow. All right, you also have a lot of olive trees and here chill out areas. Just for reference points, ladies and gentlemen, that's where the kitchen is, the dining table as well. One very spacious outdoor entertainment area that is covered with this amazing wooden beam as ceilings. The main living room area is here. We've gone into that, but not out of it. So use your imagination. You come out here and you immediately go down there. And Patrick's going to be turning the camera slowly, but you have further chill sections over there. But what's really impressive is this carved in middle staircase going down to the heated outdoor swimming pool and a guest house with two apartments that we're gonna be exploring now. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, this is amazing. Firstly, it is a fully heated swimming pool. It is also set much lower than the house, which is elevated to get all that open view to the sea. And it's kind of your different section of the house that you can come and entertain yourself with. You've got that house that my brother is putting into focus, which has two separate apartments with kitchen and bathroom. Pretty impressive. Let's have a look together. But just imagine coming here in summer, you've got friends all around, put a DJ pult here, mix it up, play some loud music, enjoy life. That's what it's all about and I keep saying it. But now, apartment number one, let's have a look. Everything you need, even vaulted ceilings. It's a perfect apartment for your guests to stay in. And I have to be quite honest, super luxurious if you think about it. My guest will have to sleep on a mattress in the corner of my room. Here you get an entire house, your own kitchen, bathroom, living room and fireplace. And that's pretty awesome. Not to forget there's a second apartment just below. There you go, you said it. Should we twist the camera and show it or what? We up? should go there right now. And just underneath of the first apartment, we have apartment number two. Let's have a look. Now, I said to Patrick when we first looked at the house, I was like, dude, all I need for my personal use would be this. So I, you would even ask the owner, hey, can I just live here? Do my YouTube videos here, my brother? It's so cool. Like I said, open plan kitchen right here. You have your guest, not guest, this is your 
shower, toilet. Should we have a quick look, Patrick? Boom, let's go. It has everything, shower, sink, cupboard spaces, and it's super self-sufficient. And that's probably the word of these two apartments which are in the pool house. And you also have this. And I'm, I have to speak for all the teenagers out there. This is what a teenager is looking for. If, you know, it's, your secret it would have been little, my dream. You know, 100%. apartment. And you can also pocket the doors. You catching it? Yep. Can you imagine, Patrick, if we were 18 or between 16 and 18, and you and I would have gotten this entire pool house for ourselves? This would be my apartment. Yours would be up there. Dude, that's so cool. But hey. Let's go back upstairs. And not to forget, this cool little play section. You've got your swings and a trampoline at the far end. This is a third income swing. Look at these pillars. Swing, yeah. And this. This is a proper trampoline. Should I try a backflip on it? Okay. You sure? Yeah. One attempt, guys. This is for the Mara Gang. Woo! <laughs> All right. Like an old man. Ladies and gentlemen, Don't come, let's go into the sun. You reach 30. It's not old. Yeah, tell everyone how old I am. Stop it. This is it. Back to my favorite diving board. Beautiful home. And from here, you get to see the glance of it. And it is on the market. It is looking for a new owner. So will are the exclusive listers. Contact details below. If you enjoyed today's property tour, are you going to jump, Dominic? If you enjoyed property tour today, you? Jump. No, it's cold. Jump in the swimming pool. No. Jump, 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 jump. No, no, no. <laughs> Better not. What should the audience do, my dear Patrick? Subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Write below the, like in the comment section. What do you think about us? Give us some tips. Not just some us, also the home. Yeah. Positive vibes. Positive vibes. Positive. All right, guys. Off to the next property tour. Thank you for tuning in. All the love from us and peace, Bye. people. <laughs>